Bob, we're in the closing day of AMA Expo West. It's been a lot of fun watching what the model segment is being uh, is doing in this day and age. Uh, every time we come out here, there's something new, there's something exciting. But at the same time, there's no question that the drone revolution has hit the model industry in a big way. And a lot of the people in the model industry recreationally are beginning to wonder, is it possible for, make, to, for me to make a living out of this business? Sounds like we need to talk. Yeah. Can you do it? Uh, yeah, absolutely. Uh, the commercial business is going leaps and bounds. In fact, probably half of the people that sign up for our flight training programs, it's either they're just getting started flying a drone and they want to get some experience with it, make sure that they fly safely. And the other group is looking at making a commercial business out of it. What do you offer to the burgeoning drone entrepreneur that will allow them to take a passion like this and turn it into a living? First of all, the FAA is looking at only the safety aspect of this, and they're very concerned with it, and consequently they're really pushing for the additional training. And as of last August, the new effective date of the Part 107 requires a drone operator to actually have a commercial license. So you have to go through that. Uh, one of our programs is a preparation class for taking that test with the FAA so they can pass the Part 107 test and get their commercial license. A lot of the people already have experience in one way, shape, or form. They're either in photography, we've got a lot of production companies that come in for training, and they have that kind of experience to begin with. And so what they want to do is they want to apply drone usage on top of what they're already doing, whether it's investigation, inspections, that kind of thing. Okay, I am Joe Q Model Aviator. If I'm getting involved with drones, I look at the regs at kind of scares me a little bit. What kind of training or assistance can you offer that person and how do they get it? Well, we start with the basic training. We've got uh, basic training and advanced training to actually learn how to fly the aircraft to begin with. We go over the rules, the regulations, where you can fly, where you can't fly, how to stay out of trouble. Basically, the airspace system is defined into either controlled or uncontrolled airspace. And the majority of the United States is uncontrolled airspace, so that's where we can fly. If you do fly in controlled airspace, you have to have approval from the FAA through air traffic control. As people transition into both uh, drone operations personally as well as commercially, what are the questions, concerns, and difficulties that you've seen in any number that need to be addressed? What are the, some of the things that folks can, and can think about as they go into it and be prepared for any uh, amount of difficulty or confusion? Well, uh, certainly to be prepared, uh, understand what it is you're doing, understand what you have to do in the, in the case of an emergency. So getting the right amount of training is really important. That's what we have done at Dart Drones is to focus on helping people get comfortable, not only with flying, but understanding what they have to do in order to be legal and safe. Finally, Bob, for those who are looking to get the kind of guidance that you can provide, how can they get in touch with you? Where do you get information on your courses? We are a national company. We offer courses across the nation, just about every major city. Some of the basic training that we offer and the primary education is online, dartdrones.com. We have a full menu of assorted courses that they can take. Well, we'll be sure to take a look at those. May even have one or two of my people run through some of it with you and see how you're doing. Thank you. All right. Explore No Limits Flying in the FAA Certified Sea Ray Amphibious LSA. One of the top three best selling LSAs in the U.S., Progressive Aerodyne Sea Ray comes equipped with a Rotax engine and exhibits extraordinary handling on land, water, and in the air. Check it out at www.searay.com. There's a difference between charting a steady course and pushing for the ceiling. And for nearly a century, Hartzell Propeller has been defining that difference. It's in our passion for engineering and research and our dedication to testing the limits of performance. We are built on honor. We are Hartzell Propeller.